Before we get into this video, please subscribe to my channel, click the bell notification button and please like this video as well. Happy New Year everybody! Welcome back to my channel. Um, it is actually Saturday the 2nd of January today and in Cumbria we've started the New Year in Tier 4 which I am not happy about, like literally. All the shops are closed and it is just awful, like, I will be in the house for God knows how long. But, on the plus side, it means I'll be able to catch up on YouTube and upload all the vlogs I filmed before Christmas, because of the tree I have a backlog of vlogs from, like, a month ago, which I seriously need to be uploaded on my channel. But yeah, but anyway, I wanted to vlog today, as I will be having a productive day. Plus, I do not have anything else to do. Like, I'm literally so bored already. It is the second day into tier four and I'm bored and I want to go out and have a good time and go to b and I think it could be open, but like, I can't be bothered and I need to save my money as well. But anyway, I did actually spend a New Year's day at Scott's as I wasn't able to get home on New Year's Eve as the roads were like all frozen over and I could have killed myself in the car. If I had a drove like on icy roads, um, I'd have to put a downer on the vlog, but um, at least I'm still here, everybody. <laughs> anyway, honestly, my head is all over the place. Like, I feel so unorganized. I look a mess. I will be putting on some makeup later because I will be filming a room tour as I love my room now, and I do actually have to take down Christmas tree behind me because it is the 2nd of January now. I will have to go to the post office today as I did sell a few items on Depop. I will have to go to the post office, yippee. Um, so I actually need to find the items. I did sell a Ted Baker makeup bag and a Nike sports bra as well, but I don't actually know where that is, so I'm hoping I still have it. Oh yeah, I do. Good, good, Alice. Good, good. There it is. Um, but if you want to follow my Depop, I think it is Alice L Holmes or something. I will put a screenshot on the screen for you all. I will be putting up some fake designer items on there soon, hopefully. At the minute, I can't actually order anything on Fover as there is a delay on shipping and everything and it, it could take ages to arrive. So like, I've also exited the EU as well, haven't we? So I don't have a clue what that means. On my way to the post office, it's actually freezing. It is a little bit icy, but it's all right. The pass on the the package is here but oh it's so cold i've got my bank card as well so i'd go back for that it just shows how organized i am but you know it's been a task and a half to get our tree out of the base and then into the garden but it's finally out oh oh my god my arms are aching there's a lot of pine leaves in the house which is fun love that oh my god look at all this oh my god it's it's all gone, it's so sad, but oh my god, have we got all them pines? Right, it's not, oh my god, it's so bright. Oh my god, it's so bright, okay. Right, I have the box here. I will be putting this in the box again, obviously. I need to go and close my curtain because that's so bright. Now that's better. That's way better. Right, time to get the little tree. Oh, oh. It's so pretty, I love it. In case you're wondering, it is Christmas tree from Asta. Oh, it's been a good one. I think I'll fold it up and keep all the baubles on the tree because it makes it so much easier. Because literally, and um, this is the worst part about like having to take everything down, isn't it? Um, like after Christmas, it's like you have to take, you have to take all your baubles off, and it takes about half an hour. <laughs> I'll just have to fold it back up again, and then it's, it's, I'll see you again. In another year, hopefully, unless I decide to buy another tree, which I might do. But yeah, this is going to be the end of our 2020 Christmas. I literally have like a, like a sweet and chocolate jar in my room, and also have like a cupboard full of like sweet and chocolate. It's so disgusting. Anyway, will this stir? I'm hoping this will stir. Oh god. Oh god. 
Oh no, what is going on here? Oh no, come on, come on, you can do it. Right, I'll just have to stuff it in the box and hope that it doesn't break. Right, well, that's gonna have to do, isn't it? Right, okay, well, that's you done. You can stay away for another year. Goodbye, Christmas 2020. <laughs> I don't even know. That's so embarrassing. Right, I have put a little bit of makeup on. Also, how come the background looks so light? There we go. Oh, that was so weird. Yeah, I've only put a little bit of makeup on because honestly, I do not have the effort today. So, I've only got some eyebrows and mascara and concealer because who has the effort to put makeup on in lockdown? I don't, anyway. But anyway, um, I want to show you all a few things that I bought like in the past week or so. On the 29th, I did go to the Metro Centre and Ikea as I did have to get a new bedside table, which is over there actually. There it is. It's the Malm drawers. I'll just show you them. They're very nice. There they are. Um, as I needed some more storage space, so I bought those for £40 and then I did go into Lush and did buy the Comforter bath bomb, which smells so good. I'll just kind of show you it. It's like, I like a sweet scent and it looks so good. Look at that bath bomb. Like, look at that. It looks so good. So, I bought that for $4.95 or $3.95. I'm not quite sure because I look for bath bombs. And I did get a few Lush items for Christmas as well. So I literally have a whole collection of Lush items, but I'm not complaining. Also, in Ikea, I did get three wick vanilla candle, which I will be lighting today. And then, in Elster yesterday, I did buy another candle, but I'm obsessed with candles. I bought a cherry Yankee candle for £6. And the burn hours on this is... 40 to 60 hours so I will be using this oh, and just smells so good oh my god and six pounds is a bargain um, and like I still did have a lot of money off all the candles so I had to get one but yeah but that's all I bought but now I think I'll go and make some food I kind of fancy a chicken pizza because they are so good I do need to kind of clean my room a little bit as we'll be filming a room too soon um so yeah um i'm kind of organizing um this whole area here because it is a bit of a mess at the minute and i've been using a winter cherry fabulosa spray to clean my room with and it smells bloody beautiful but yeah um i think i'll go and open this because it smells beautiful and i want to light it asap and i'll have to find some more space for the items to go on there but i don't have a clue what to put on there at the minute so i'll find something i know i will i have my cozy dressing gown on it's so warm and cozy it is a plt one there we go plt on the back um i've had my lunch i did have a greg's sausage roll and some spaghetti cubes onto it that combo is unreal like it was so good <laughs> and I will be having, of course, some chocolate. I'm surprised I still have half a bar left as chocolate is my addiction. Like, it's so good. Like, how can you say no to some galaxy chocolate? I'm sorry, but you just can't. <laughs> Look at it. So good. Mmm. Mmm, wow. Room to it is all finished now thank god for that and the lighting was going really weird on the camera and like it was going all like that really and it was so awkward to film i finally filmed it now and i will have to pack everything away and i might be going on a little walk like an hour or so maybe if i can't be bothered to go on a walk because honestly i don't have any effort at the minute but i will have to go and take all of my gins downstairs i got these all for christmas i got yourself a secret santa scott's parent grapefruit one which looks so good and smells delicious and then a blood orange off scott and i love them so much um so 
her will be having a party tonight. <laughs> I wish. <laughs> of course, I won't be having a party. I'm in tier four, guys, by the way. And then I did get a bottle of rosé and wine because I do love rosé. And then a mug and a hot chocolate as well, which I'm kind of craving. I'm kind of craving a hot chocolate today. So I might actually have one, you know, because especially in the winter season, I love having like hot chocolates all the time. But yeah, but I'm like so bored and I don't have a clue what to do, but I'll find something to do because I need to keep occupied. Um, I, I'll do some editing and some college work actually. It's actually a good shout. I'm about to go and use the hot chocolate set off Scott. That's the hot chocolate in it, the, the marshmallows and the mini whisk with it as well. Make today amazing, which I love. Um, I will have to watch this out, obviously. But oh my god, how cute is that? And the little packet. Oh my god, I can't wait. I'm so excited. Time to make the hot chocolate. There we go. The mugs are clean. I'll just go and open this up. How cute is the packaging? That is so cute. Oh my god, it's This isn't a full one, is it? No, I think it is actually. Let's open this bad boy up. Ready? Come on then. Come on then. Let's get this all in. It's so cute. Right, now time for the... I'll be able to use the whisk with this. That's going to be so cute. Right, look at this. <laughs> I'm really excited to use this, I don't know why I use this. Oh my god, it's so good for stirring hot chocolate, do it. Oh my god, I love it. Wow, this is so cool. Oh, it, look, it smells so good and, oh, look at that. Hi, I love these so much. These are so nice. Let's try and pour them in. Probably won't even go in that way. Well, go on, go in. Oh, look how delicious that looks, everybody. Cheers. <laughs> it's now time to light a candle so look what i'm gonna do oh i can't wait to burn this it smells so good come on burn burn baby burn oh yes that is it also i want to show you guys this cleaning drawer underneath my bed because i'm obsessed look at how much th things have in here i'll just try and lift it up for you Palm Violet Spray, <laughs> yes please. Uh, I got it off Scott, a, like a, a Che Fabulosa thing. Some cleaning pads, a rediffuser, all sorts in there, some dusters, a lot of carpet sprays in there, all sorts of perfectant sprays. Look at them. And some new cleaning pads but which i am in need of but yeah and i also have a couple of refills for my read diffuser thing because i could plug in um oh, what's it called summer scent i think which are very nice so yeah but here is my cleaning drawer and oh my god i am obsessed with palm violet i love this scent so much i just oh beautiful it's really hard to Yes. Oh, beautiful. I'm so happy I got this. So I've decided to have a bath tonight because I did get a few bath bombs for Christmas. Um, so I thought that I would use one. So um, I'll open up this tin of bath bombs. Oh my God, it smells of a lush shop in here. Um, I'm kind of thinking... Um, I got a bath bomb for Scott's parents and it was like a peachy one. I think I want to use that one because it looks very nice. Let's try and find it. I do have a lot of things in your mind. <laughs> um, where could it be? I'll take all these ones out. This one. This one, yeah, it is this one. It's a little peachy one. I'll, I'll put all these away because I do have a lot. Look at all that stuff in here. It smells incredible. How nice this bath bomb is. Look how nice. It smells of peach. Like, very really nice. It's so pretty. I can't wait to use that in my bath. Oh, <laughs> who's the lucky one here? <laughs> I love it. Now time to put the bath bomb in. I'm gonna get it out of here. 
I also have a little condom over there to kind of make it like a bit more chill. Oh, look at that beauty. I cannot wait to use that. Ready? Ooh. Oh, okay. Oh, it smells so good. Oh my God, it smells amazing. Oh my God, the colour is beautiful. Look at that. I'm out to the bath now. And I'm in. These pages, they're so fluffy, so lovely and warm. Honestly, the bath felt like a spa, um, as I did have a couple of candles on. And I did, I did play some spa music on my Bluetooth speaker and it was just so, so relaxing and so peaceful. And just overall, I loved every second of it. It was incredible. But yeah, but, in, uh, but anyway, um, I will be ending this vlog here so really so I really hope that I can't speak now. I really hope that you guys have enjoyed this vlog. If you have make sure to leave a thumbs up, comment down below and please subscribe because it is free. I would love to hit my goal of four thousand subscribers so please subscribe and I'll see you all in my next video. Bye everybody!